Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Stormworks video. Today we are continuing on with our plane right here, as you guys can see. In the previous video, uh, we ended up actually building a cockpit kind of area, as you guys can see right here. Uh, we've got two throttle levers, we've got a compass. Um, these are going to be the engine stats, so like we're going to have temperature, RPS, and stuff like that on each one of these. Uh, then we're going to have speed on the outer ones, and we're also going to have the altitude on the other one. Um, hopefully. Uh, we also need fuel, so we'll probably put fuel on one of these as well, uh, on both sides. Uh, we'll see what happens though. Um, that should all go quite okay. Um, so, going back to what you guys have actually been saying in the comments down below. Uh, one of the comments was that we should actually have uh, use for this area underneath. Now, you are correct, that's probably a good idea. Now, you were saying for the front bit, in the nose, we could actually have like a, uh, a little office kind of thing. Uh, and I feel like that's a cool idea. We might even be able to put some windows in. Um, and that'd be quite, quite interesting. Uh, then if we block off this area here, probably in this section, um, we can have like a fuel storage area, and also a storage area for fuel that we will get from um, like missions and stuff, so we can deliver fuel. Or... Or we could be a water bomber, so we can actually drop water on fires and things. Not entirely sure which route I want to do first, um, but I, I like the idea of this office, so we'll probably do that. Um, and then we'll sort of section this off into little sections, um, so that this bit is airtight except from the cargo bay. Because we can't, we can't actually seal this. Um, but we'll see what happens. I might also put a vertical stabilizer on the back, um, and yeah, it should be fun. Um, then after that, in the next video, we'll probably end up doing the wings. Maybe. Okay, so first things first, let's go ahead and try and figure out this area. So, um, I do want to go back in here. We want to section this off. Uh, we're going to section it off here, actually. Uh, and I want to do it on both sides. So we're going to leave three, a gap of three. And we're going to raise it up there. Um, we need like doors or hatches or something. We need something to be able to get into here. Uh, we need, then need to block off this area. Because um, it's necessary. It is necessary. There we go. In fact, we'll just use hatches to get through everywhere. Uh, it just seems like the logical thing to do. Um, or we could have mini doors. We could actually put mini doors in. Let's do mini doors. I don't, I don't know whether this is a good idea. Um, but mini doors sounds like fun. So, uh, we'll actually need to delete these as well, yes, and these, and we'll bump our heads off things, but that should be fine. So, uh, door, here we go, uh, we actually need these things, yep, and they need to go in the floor. They need to go in the floor, just like that. Then we can do this one, actually no, it goes on there like this, whoops, whoa, uh, like this there we go uh and this is how small the doors are gonna be that is bigger than a hatch though and that's a good thing so there you go actually no we can't do them like that they're not big enough because we we don't have enough room for a hinge it has to be at least three right uh unless it's two no it's three yeah these aren't big enough mm. we're gonna have to use hatches then that's fine um so put those back in the floor we need to fix that that's okay and this one I mean, it's the thought that counts, though. Uh, we almost, we almost had a plan. Uh, right, okay, so, detach this, delete this. Okay, delete this one as well. And we need a hatch. Yes. Okay, so, uh, we're going to go ahead and put a hatch uh, right here. Yep. Uh, we're going to do the same thing right here. Ba -ba 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 -bom. There we go. We're actually going to do, yeah, that's fine, like that. Uh, we're then going to put the button in the top bit. That seems like a good idea. There we go. Fill in this piece as well. And yeah, that's quite smart. So, we need buttons. Yes. Uh, which is going to be a toggle button right here. Boop. And we're also going to put a toggle button right here. Boop. There we go. So, they're going to control each of these. So, that controls there. And that controls there. That was easy enough. Um, then what we could do is let's just give them all power from each other there we go we do need a space for batteries and stuff and i need to figure out what these areas are for okay that's that's fine this though doesn't need to be here um neither does this 
All right, cool, fantastic. Uh, that's the outside. That is obviously that piece that is there, which actually, to be fair, um, what we could do is just delete it <laughs> and put in a block and then delete this completely. Same with this one. Delete that and that, put a block in, and I think that'll be fine. Like, what does it look like on the outside? Mm, yeah, and then we delete this, and then, 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 we put in one of these. Right here. Okay. And I feel like that probably looks better anyway. Yeah. It looks better on the inside and the outside. Perfect. So, um, this front room is fine. I wanted to put a hatch in here so we could go downstairs, which will be weird. Ah, oh, it will be strange. Uh, but we can do it. We can do it. Okay, so delete those three and then these. Okay. We then need a hatch of sorts. There we go. Uh, and it should probably be this color. There we go. Same as the floor. Yep. And then we put that there. That's not actually the same as the floor. Interesting. Very, very interesting. There we go. Um, and then we need a button that can go right there. Uh, which will be attached to this thing. Oh, there we go. Logic that to there. Might as well attach it to there as well. And then attach that to there as well. And that means we can go down into the bottom. Yes. Things are getting very interesting here. So we'll do this. We'll actually fill in all of this. There we go. Uh, and we need a mini room. <laughs> need a mini room so this can go in the floor yes that can go that can go right there then we'll obviously we'll jug this bit so the rest of it's right uh, and actually what we'll do is grab the paint do that okay and then jug the rest and that should leave this the same yes it does okay so this whole area downstairs needs to be secured uh, and needs to look pretty-ish. Pre pretty-ish. If we can have windows, that would be cool. Um, that's straight to the outside. Yeah, but we probably want it back one. Uh, we can't have it there. Actually, we can have it there. Uh, delete these. Yes. And delete this bit as well. Wait, what is this? Oh, okay, right, that's good. Uh, so we'll put that in, okay. We'll then paint it, because we need to paint the roof as well. It's not going to be that color. Uh, there we go. And the roof itself is going to be this color. No, it's not. It needs to be different, like that. That'll do, that'll do. Uh, and we'll put potholes in. This might look weird. It, it probably does look weird. Um, and we need it to be in the same color as everything else. So there we go. Put a little window in. Yeah, that's actually quite cool looking. I like that. Yeah, we'll have like one window, maybe even two. Do we fit two? If I delete this and I put that there, and then we delete this piece. Uh, is there a hole? There is a hole. However, we can just put one of these in. So, like, we'll put this here and drag it across. And then at least we'll get a little bit of light in, and it won't look too weird. That's the plan. <laughs> that is the plan indeed. All right, cool. That's all good. Uh, let's do this. There we go. Paint those ones. Yeah, that's fine. So, we're going to have to crouch and stuff while we're down here. Uh, but we can get rid of that. And that's fine. Okay, right. Cool. Can we fit a seat? We can. We can fit a seat in here. Um, What would it be used for? I guess this can just be used for carrying people. Yeah. Let's just have a bunch of seats. There we go. We can ferry people around in this thing. Um, and then we're going to barrier off the front. And we'll have a bunch of stuff in there, I guess. I'm not too sure, like, what I want. What I want to use this for. Maybe a med bed. Ooh, that's a good idea. A medical bed. Can I fit one of those in here? Yes, I can. Can we raise it up by at least, like, one, maybe? There we go. Put the med bed in there somewhere. Da, da 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 Yep. Okay, right there. And we'll probably have it red. There you go, because it's a med bed. Alright, awesome. That is pretty cool. Yeah, so we got the med bed there. Um Do we need anything else? I don't think we need anything else just yet, right here. 
Uh, so we're just going to shove this on there. That's fine. And yeah, this whole room is actually pretty cool. I like it. Uh, how do we get out, though? <laughs> this seat's going to have to go. That seat is going to have to go. Um, hmm. Currently unsure of what to do. Can we actually get out of there? Yeah. I think so. Um, okay. Yeah, this is fine. We should be able to jump out. Uh, and in fact, actually, we'll put a ladder in. Not a ladder. We'll put, um, put a handle here. If we can, we need to go in this thing and see if we can get in and out of this, but that looks fine to me. Yeah, we should be able to climb out using this. I think, I don't really know. I don't know what's going on. Um, I'm just excited. Like, I'm actually really pleased with the way this is going so far. We obviously don't want these things. That's fair. Um, but those little porthole windows, they look so good on a seaplane. Yeah, nice. I like it. Okay, so now we've got a tiny issue. All right, maybe it's a bigger than tiny issue. We've got an issue with weight. Um, when I say weight, I mean we're going to have to put fuel in here. And the fuel is going to have to be quite large. It's going to have to be quite a large tank. So, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this situation right here. Okay. Uh, we probably want to do it on both sides, actually. So, do this. Cross. Yes. We're then going to get... Um, oh, gyros probably cost a lot in rogue mode. That is what we're using this for, by the way. The, the whole point of this plane is to be used in rogue mode. Uh, so we're going to do this. And you might be wondering why I'm doing it to the outside. And the reasoning is that um, I don't want more fuel. I want more. I, I want less, less weight. Uh, and that's why I'm doing it on the top and not in the fuel tank. Uh, in case you were wondering. So there we go. Um, go ahead and block this right here. This is probably not enough fuel. However, if we can attach it to the wings somehow, that would be amazing. Be very good, actually. Because uh, we could store a little bit in the wing. And in fact, that's a good idea. So we'll do this here. Yep. Yeah. Uh, we'll attach it to this one also. So we'll do this sort of situation here. We'll have a little bit of fuel right there. Uh, it's all going to be one fuel tank, so that's all right. Yep, that one gets fuel from there. This one gets fuel from here. Um, we then need to build like a little corridor thing downwards into here. Okay, right. How do we do this then? So uh, it only needs to be one. Fine. So we go here. Delete this. Delete that one. Go down, down, up. There we go. Fill in this, go down. Okay. There we go. We're in the bottom. We're in the basement. That's good. Uh, we'll then drag this down to here. Drag this down to here. And bring it along. Okey And then we'll bring it down. Straight into there. That's the outside. Straight into here. There we go. Yeah, that's the right place. Good. So we'll build this up. Okay. It's all going to be one fuel tank. Like, one continuous fuel tank. Don't really know if this is the best way of doing it, but probably not, let's be honest. Uh, but we'll get a lot more fuel out of doing it this way. So that's good. There we go. So we'll have fuel in our wings. We'll have fuel all the way down here. All the way in this bit. And then all the way in our fuel tank at the bottom. Perfect! Yes! Alright, so... Let's go ahead and put fuel in and we'll see how it sits. <laughs> uh, fluid. Port. No, not the pot. We don't want a pot. We don't need a pot. Fauna. Uh, and actually, we're not going to do it on that side. We'll do it on this side. Reason being. Okay. And I do have a reason here. And that can go there. That's fine. Uh, we'll have a meter as well so we can see how much. And if we delete this, we've actually got more room. <laughs> yeah, we do. But this probably will mean that we won't float. I don't think we'll float. Not very well, at least. We'll see. It is floating. It is actually floating. Uh, I'm assuming that this is going to be underwater. Yes. It is. So we need to be more buoyant. Which means we need less... We need less fuel. That's a lot of fuel. Uh, less fuel in the back. So... We could extend the back be slightly bigger, therefore it can have more 
buoyancy. Uh, I mean, that is a possibility. Do we do that, though? Do we, do we really do that? You know what we do? Yeah, we do. We do do that. All right, let's do it. Here we go. So we connect this to the rest of it. Just like that. Sorry about the fart noise. It's just a fart noise. Out of my mouth. I didn't pump. Didn't pump. Do you guys call it pumping? I don't know. Anyway, right, do this. Okay, we're going to grab all of this and we're going to be moving it all backwards. A bit. Uh, quite a bit. That's fine. All right, paste that there. Um, we then need to seal it the same way we've sealed that one. And we also need to basically just take this section. Uh, right here. This section. Yep, just go ahead and copy it. Move it backwards. Oh, it's so close. I need two less. Okay, paste it here. Go ahead and do this. Two less. Go ahead and cut it. Move it down. There we go. Move it backwards. Paste it. Oh, no. If I paste it, does it get rid of those? Yes, it does. Ah, okay, whatever. We can put those back in. That's fine. Uh, so we need to delete all of this. Which appears to be sort of impossible for some reason. Alright, delete all of it. There we go. Delete all of this. And all of this. And all of this. Alright, cool. So that's all gone. We then merge this with this. Uh, this with this. This with this. Yep. We fill in these holes. Yes, we do. We delete this bit. And we put in one of these. Uh-huh. Yes, we do. Okay, we press U. Yeah, that's right. I'm pretty sure. Merge this with this. This with this. This with this. And then we got a much longer plane. Which looks weird. It does look strange. Not going to lie. Not going to lie. Okay, do this. Do this. Um, delete. Don't worry. Don't worry. Everything is fine. We don't want to do it on both sides. Just one side. Do this. Okay. Delete this. Grab a door. Can I grab this door? There we go. Put that there. Uh, yeah, like that. Go ahead and put this here and this here. And then we need a button. Like, that's a handle. What? How did I get a handle? There we go. Get a button. Go ahead and put the button in here. Merge the button together with this piece. And this. There we go. Good. Again, that was my mouth, not my butt. Okay, good. Touch that to there. Touch it to here and here and to here. And then connect this one to this one. That is fine. Yes. Okay, so we got a much longer plane. That means that the wings probably need to be bigger. Ah, oh, I've just made a mess. I just made more of a mess than I had before. If it takes off with wings this small, we're going to do it. Don't worry. Everything is fine. Delete that. Okay, delete this one. Right, let's see if it floats. Uh, is this all secure? I think it is. Spawn it in. See what happens. So it's front heavy. Bad thing to begin with. Uh, the cargo bay is fine. Just. Cargo bay is fine just. Alright, so we're going to get rid of the fuel all the way at the front. Da, 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 da. All of this is going to go away. Go away. Uh, and then all of this is just empty. We could put more rooms in here and stuff, but we don't. I guess we could put, like, beds in. Or hammocks and stuff. Still front heavy. Um... Yeah, we're still alright, though. We need to be more floaty. What if I was wider? What if it? What if the entire plane was wider? But only a bit. That would make it more buoyant. It would. But making it wider is... Not easy. That is not an easy job. Alright, you know what? Just for now, uh, we're going to actually start on the tail section. And we'll try and make it look pretty and stuff. So, we're going to make it very large uh, to begin with. We're going to make it blend in. So, it's going to go four, four... 
then two. Actually, no, four again. Four, four, four. And four again. Yep. There we go. Then two. And then two. And then uh, a single one. And then two up. Uh, and then two up. There we go. There we go. And then two up. And then four. No, two up again. And then four up. Is that going to work? And then like two up. Yep. And then one up. And then that's it. Um, I think that's too, too short this way for the top section. Let's add pieces. There's one, one, and a bit. Go ahead and add this. So this is a two. There we go. Do this one so it's a two. Do this one so it's a four. That two. That's not right. I don't like it. Let's make that a two. Okay. This is a two. And then we'll go one. And then we'll do twos. So that's a two right there. Good. And twos again. I don't know if you guys even know or are following what I'm even saying right now. That's a two. So this is a two. This is a two. Two. This is a one. And that is a one. Sure. <laughs> sure. So uh, basically what I was actually doing was I was putting in a foundation for these to be added. Uh, which are fours, then we need twos, which are these things, and then we need ones, which are the ones. So literally just add this here and here, and then do these ones, here and here, and also here and here and here and here. Then we'll add these pieces, which are ones, to there, to there, and to these two. Does that look alright for a tail fin? I think it does, maybe. I think that looks fine. Um, and then we need to add a control surface, um, which will allow us to be betters or something. Large. Yeah. That's a big old control surface right there. It's a huge control surface, actually. Um, okay, good. We'll have this go down like a little bit. Yep. Um, and actually, we need to add the horizontal stabilizers at the top of this. So we're going to do something along the lines of this. Okay, so we need to come out of here quite a bit. Yep, because they're going to be out, they're going to have to be quite big. That's fine. Uh, we're going to start with a four. So one, two, three, four. Delete these. We're going to go with another four, I think, and then twos. So two. Two, two, and then ones. There we go. I guess that'll work. Yep. So go ahead and put this in here. Then we need twos, which is these ones. Then we need fours, which is these ones. Yeah, that'll do. But actually, uh, to make this look a little bit nicer, delete these. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go, and there we go. All right, cool. So, uh, what you want to do to make the edges of your wings look nicer, if they're only one block, uh, is use the new blocks. Use these. So, what you'll see is the front end starts to get round, or rounder. Uh, so, that looks prettier, doesn't it? Yeah. So, then we'll use these ones, which are twos. Uh, all the way, so up to here. And then we use ones, which is just these, back to there. And then we can actually just round off this edge with this. Uh, and that looks all right to me, I think. Looks like a bit of a whale fin, but that'll do. Okay, cool. So, we now have a big old area for putting in a control surface like this one. Um, which does fit. I think I'd rather put it... I don't think we should have massive ones. I think we should use the slightly smaller one. Medium. Yeah. Maybe. I don't know. Is this a bad idea? Possibly. Possibly not. I don't know. Uh, medium. Yeah. We're going to have to use them at some point. So 
We'll just do that. There we go. Attach all of these together. And flatten off the back ends, I think. Like this. Uh, okay. Yeah. So we'll have to see how that works. I'm not too sure how it'll work. Um, but we'll see, because it looks... I think it looks alright. Let's spawn it in, see? Um... I think that looks okay. Uh, I mean, the plane is too long now. It is definitely too long now. Um, and I'm not sure we'll be able to take off. We could actually test that out at the minute. We could. Uh, even without wings. Because <laughs> we still don't have wings. We need to do that next time. Um, I do want to be able to get inside of this. So, what I'm actually going to do is delete a hole in the roof. Hopefully it'll still float. It should still float. Yeah. Okay, cool. So, we can get in here. There is water in here. That's fine. It's flooding backwards. That's okay. Uh, you can crawl all the way through. All the way through the back. This is fine. Okay, that's filling. This is filling as well. And this is filling. And also downstairs is probably filling. Yep. Um, but you can get in every room. That's fine. Okay. We should probably do it with a sealed door. But anyway, um, I think what we've actually got here is a good base. However, well, I think it does need to be wider <laughs> in some sort of, in some fashion. I'm not sure what fashion, but it needs to be wider than it is. So, I don't know. I think I might end this video here. Uh, we've added the fuel. Um, yeah, okay. We've made it a little bit longer and we've put the tail fin on, but we, we might need to make it wider. That's dangerous. But it might have, uh, it might be the only way of making it more floaty. Unless, 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 unless. So we've got the float plane bit here. Um, and we need an extra bit of flotation here, right? Correct? I think so. Um, on real life float planes, they sometimes have like extra sections on this bit that poke out, um, that make the bottom a bit flatter. Uh, in in certain areas, uh, and also they sort of form their own little wing sometimes. Uh, so we could have like a, a little wing down here uh, that'll allow us to get up in the air and be a little bit of flotation, as well as this pontoon and maybe one on the end of the wing as well. We'll see. I'm not sure, um, but I think I'm gonna end this one here. So thank you guys for watching. If you guys have any ideas on how to make this work a little bit better, if I didn't have this, we wouldn't actually have many problems at all or any problems. Uh, it's just that messes with things a little bit. Um, but anyway, uh, I want to say thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.